السلام عليكم معي السيدونز جوت في البوك في بيج وات يو ار ان بيج وات انا عندك تاني بيج ايت ويلكم فيهم معي في المكان سكول ان شاء الله في بيج ويل توك نيو ريسون فلاو ترانسبورت بلانس بيج ترانسبورت بلانس I will revise various transportive plans one by one with me. That's in, in page 100. I want all the students to take part. Uh, in the epidermis, here we have the epidermal vascular plan. Go to page 111. Now, all the students with me. I want to ask now first, then we go to transport. I want to ask someone now. Okay. You take part with me. My voice is clear. Someone raise their hand and say, My voice is clear for you or not? My student, okay, yeah. My voice is clear, yeah. Yeah. Assalamu alaikum. Yet, want another one? Yes, Mister. Yeah, yeah, with me. Yeah, my voice is. Yeah, Mister. Yeah, but it's slow. It's slow. Like the screen in front of you is clear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, thanks. So today, inshallah, I will try to start to revive transport England, then transport England. But I will revive transport England. I think we have them, but I want to revise in some points. Okay. Uh, now, yeah, give me what is the uh, vascular bundle, you know? Vascular bundle, you remember? It is between xylem and the what? Yeah. You don't hear me? Another one? Yes, mister. Uh, it contains xylem and ploin. Xylem and ploin, thanks. Uh, so, in this page, if you remember the vascular boundary here, you see it. Not a group, this, it's a main group of specialized cells. This is what, one of them conduct protein. Okay, okay, I will, I will ask another. Oh, don't worry. So, safety found in flowing of the animal. Go to this, uh, okay, this is now, okay. If you go to save you here. Safe tube here that is the same tube. In the safe tube, it's found in the environment on the floor. Who can answer? Safe tube, I'm answering now because in the beginning I will ask, then I will continue. Found in the or on the floor. Okay. Safe tube, found in the or on the floor. I won't. Okay, no one could not answer. Okay, not far. Uh, Mister, the, you said safe tubes come in what? A phloem or xylem? Phloem or xylem? A phloem. Thanks. Thank you. Uh, just so we go to other page, we are arriving now. Function of vein uh, like a stein. We said that uh, cortex and the best good meet the book. Uh, we said what is the transport exactly? What is the function of the dynamo? Uh, what do you call transport in the zyanum? We said it and transpiration. We uh, are okay. We are in video 116 in transpiration now. Okay, you see me that the transpiration. What is transpiration exactly? What is transmigration exactly? I want to ask also with my student, Mashallah, will be it. Okay, the heck, how are you? What is transmigration? Uh, transmigration is the loss of water vapor uh, from the leaves by evaporation. Thanks. Okay, uh, now, other questions? 
about, we will ask about now, about translocation. What is translocation? Who oh, no. What is translocation? Okay, I will choose. What is translocation, my students? Four? Yeah? Translocation? Translocation is the movement of saccharose and amino acid uh, through the plant in the foliar. So, from the place, from the source to the same. Thanks, from the source to the same. Uh, what is the source and what is the same? What is the source? Uh, source is the place where uh, food is produced. Thanks. I want another one. The same. I want the yeah, other we said. Hashim, you know? You know what is the same? You know, thanks. What's the sink? Uh, yeah, so sink is the place uh, where they are used, where they are stored. I mean. Thanks for that. Thanks for that. Mashallah, grade eight. Mashallah, excellent. Mashallah, from the from the excellent student. Thank you, grade eight. Allah, you studied well. Uh, okay, we want now to go to transport. Okay, all of the students go to the book to page one hundred twenty-six. Today, I will explain transport in animal. Inshallah, the next time we will put questions on the bus people. Who really has a hand? I want just a moment. Okay. Who really has a hand now? What do you want from? Okay. For, what do you want? Mister, I can't hear you well. I cannot hear you well. You can. You hear me? You, you hear me well now? No, your voice is way too far. I barely hear you. I can. You don't hear at all, but the but the voice. But, Your voice is lacking. It is way too far. Yeah, I will. Well, the voice is okay. No, but, um, you hear me? You hear me? Uh, if I talk now, I'm talking now. When I'm talking now. That's okay now. Yes, no, that's, it is. Yeah, that's okay now. Thanks. So you hear me well now. So I will explain more. I will explain now transport an animal. Then the next time it will, uh, we will inshallah take pass paper in the, in the transport an animal. The pass paper inshallah will reach it to you for inshallah and all the students. I will send it, uh, send it to the inshallah. You will study well from the book and just the pass paper, you will solve the pass paper. I will inshallah send it to you, to the group, to the, okay, Hur? You hear me well now? Yes, alhamdulillah. Okay, thanks. Uh, first, I want someone to give me what if the trans generally what if transport? It is movement of substance, okay? Movement of substance. But in, in case of uh, okay, plants is different from in case of animals. Here we have some participants. We have transport who can say for you are okay. Now, transport in animals. Transport in animals is different from single circulation and double circulation. Single circulation, okay, as you see in the fish, that is the fish here. So, that is in page what? We are in page 124. All of the students will meet in page 124 now. So now, the blood here in single circulation, the fish have the simplest circulatory system for all vertebrates. A heart consists just of one blood collecting chamber. One blood collecting chamber. One minute, this one. That one chapter. One blood collecting chamber. This is called the atrium. And one blood ejection chamber, the ventricle. So we have just atrium, we have just a ventricle in the cave of fish. It send the blood to the jaw. Just that the, 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 the fish is by by jaw, but the human is by by lung as you know. The blood here, okay, flow to all parts of the body to return to the heart just once or just one time. This is called single circulation. This is called the what? Single circulation. This is called the single circulation, you know? 
just single circulation. Okay? Now, the single circulation that the blood goes through the heart once, one time. From the heart, then to the bars, and then it returns to the heart. Just one time. Okay? This is a single, single circulation. It is different from double circulation. It is different from double circulation. Means that and instead of blood go in, 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 in one time, it will go to times or go to the heart. Okay? Through that is the double. You see the heart. Then the the heart contain left and right, okay? The heart in human consists of four chamber. This chamber, left atrium, left ventricle, right atrium, right ventricle. I will repeat. The heart in the human, uh, exactly, consists of four chamber. Left atrium, left ventricle, right atrium, right ventricle. So, in the pulmonary, the pulmonary artery, artery send the blood from the right atrium to the heart and return to the lungs, return to the heart another time, then the heart will push the blood all over the body then return to the blood. Do we have two times here? So it's called the double circulation here. It's called the double circulation here. This is one. The double circulation. Double. Why? Because it will go to the heart. Then the body, uh, the heart, I'm sorry, is into the lungs, that's one time. From the lungs to the heart, then to the body, return another time, that's two times. So we have two times here, so it's called, okay, it's called what? Double circulation. Understand? It's called the double circulation here. Okay? If you go to here, a double circulation, a double, all of them. The blood passes twice here. The plus passes twice here. This one. Twice, passes twice. Okay, through the heart during one complete circuit. But in the single circuit, it just passes once through complete circuit. Okay, so it goes from the body then to uh, okay, the heart. It will go from the heart to the lung and the lung. Lungs to the heart, heart to the body, and everything another time, but two circle. Okay. The circulation through the lung is called the pulmonary circulation. This one, from where? From the, from the heart to the lungs. It's called the pulmonary circulation. But the circulation from the heart all over the body is called systematic circulation. So we have two circulation here. Okay, now I give you, inshallah, I, I will give you two minutes to think in this question. What is the difference between now single circulation and double circulation? What is the difference between single circulation and double circulation? Inshallah, I, I see a lot of participants. Okay, now Tariq, you said, yes, and you don't sit today. Okay, you know well? Okay, give me. Uh, yeah. Mr. Uh, single circulation, in single circulation, the blood goes through the heart once, every time it goes through the whole body. But in yes. double circulation, it goes through the heart twice when it goes through the whole body. Okay. Okay, that's just one difference. I want another difference. Another one, no? I want another difference between single circulation. In point of pressure, I will give you two minutes to read it well between single circulation, double circulation. Then you ask as well. Okay? Then I will listen to you. I will give you two minutes to think. How do you know well? Huh? You know? Uh, single circulation happens in fish and double circulation happens in mammals like humans and, and uh, rats. Thanks, yeah. thanks a lot. Thanks, excellent. I want another difference. Huh? Who can? Omar? Yeah? Uh, yes, Mr. In the double circulation, it's maintaining a high blood pressure. Thanks. But uh, in the uh, single circulation, it's less than it. Thanks, thanks a lot. Thanks, thanks a lot. Okay. 
Um, I want where is Sarum? Muhammad Sarum, yeah. Yes, sir. Um, so in a single circulation, there's uh, two chambers, and uh, and in uh, and in double circulation, there's uh, four chambers. Thanks, thanks a lot. Another question. So now you know well, but now uh, what about the heart? I will ask, but after I have experience. Thank you, sir, for the students who participate. Thanks a lot. Uh, you are a good student. Now I want to uh, think about, about what uh, we have. Again, we will explain the heart. You don't explain the heart. Okay, I will choose the girls. Okay, I want to ask the girls now. One of the girls. I want to ask uh, in one of the girls, they talk the heart or no? Okay. Hur, you took the heart or no? Okay, Hur? Yes. You took the, you took the heart in the school? You took the, you, fin you, you finished chapter... You finish chapter nine or no? No, we did not. So now we are talking about the heart, but just you took that. After that, you don't talk, okay? We took we took the topic about the heart before in grade seven, but in grade eight, I did not. No, no, no. I I don't. I I am talking about grade eight. You don't took the heart. No, we did not. You don't took chapter nine. So I'm okay. Thanks, 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 thank we you. Not, we did not finish. Uh, we did not finish chapter seven. In chapter seven, but we are explaining the last one about uh, uh, nutrition, and we are explaining, and we will revise another one. Don't worry, the next time, don't worry. But chapter eight, we talk with me, okay? Yes. Chapter that's chapter nine. All of it, chapter seven, you don't talk, or just uh, just one. I, I think uh, I'm explaining the the last week about the chapter seven, and chapter eight. But I will revise, no problem. I will revise it, no problem. Okay. But now in okay. chapter eight, you don't talk at all? No, we did not. Okay, so thanks. Thank you, Hor. Now, thank, thanks a lot. Uh, now, follow me. Follow me. The heart consists of four chambers. I will ask. I will explain, then ask. This four chamber, they are, look at me, please, one minute. This four chamber are right atrium, okay, right ventricle. Left atrium and left ventricle. The blood goes from the heart here to the lungs from the from the right ventricle here to the lungs. Okay. But from here, it will go to lower the body from here. It will go to the body here. So the blood here is oxygenated. The blood, blood here is deoxygenated blood, contains carbon dioxide. Understand? Between each atrium and ventricle, there is a valve here. There is a valve between the rift atrium and ventricle. There is a valve. Why? To prevent blood flow of the blood. There is a septum between the right and left here. You see it? That is the septum. The septum to okay to separate between oxygenated blood and and uh, and deoxygenated blood. So they don't okay mix it with each other. The blood okay on the on the side of your fist, as you as you see, okay. So it is very important for you to um, to uh, read the blood wall or to draw the blood. Okay, we have two important. V, uh, arteries here and two important veins. The two important veins are vena cava from upper and lower, and the two important artery is aorta and pulmonary. This is aorta and this is pulmonary, it's very important. Aorta, this one, and pulmonary, this one. Okay, this one, aorta, all over the body, aorta. Take the blood to all over the body. But um, just the, okay, pulmonary, okay, artery, it's aorta all over the body. 
pulmonary artery just uh, take the blood just to the to the lungs okay you must to differentiate between all of these understand now thanks a lot okay understand me well now so go to the other page about this bitch about this that is the heart exactly the heart muscle this heart muscle here we'll draw it for you one minute that is the heart muscle here well, that's the heart muscle here. about the heart there is a heart muscle the heart muscle supplied with food and the oxygen we all supplied what supplied the food that is called the coronary arteries here which supply the blood with the arteries. so we have three important arteries, pulmonary artery, this one, we have aorta, this one, and we have coronary arteries. Plus coronary arteries, just send the blood, okay? Send the blood to the heart, or supply the blood, supply the heart with food and oxygen. So I will repeat, the heart must supply with food and oxygen by coronary arteries, but pulmonary arteries send the blood just to this one, send the blood to the lungs. Okay, let's send the blood here to all over the body, to the body or to the body cells. Push it this one, you know. Okay, I want to ask now some students if they understand or no. See some students. Okay. What does the uh, what does uh, what does the heart consist of? Who oh, no. What does the heart consist of? How many chamber of the heart? I want someone to describe me the heart. Saram, we said Saram, Mustafa Khalid. Okay, Mustafa Khalid. Uh, Mr. We have four chambers. Okay. Four chamber, thanks. Uh, I want someone to give me what are the four chamber. Hashim, I think Hashim, you will send it to me. Yad, will you uh, take part with me? I want another one. Sorry, another one now. Okay, Mustafa Saleh, you don't take part or take part with me, Mustafa? What are the four chambers? Uh, Mr. The four samples, Mr. I think the 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 right upper one, Mr. Contain the vena cava and the right artium, and uh, uh, and Mr. The lower uh, the lower right one contain vena cava and the right vert uh, ventricle, and uh, the uh, the, lef the left upper one, Mr. Contain the artery, uh, the artery and the aorta, and per uh, pulmonary artery. This uh, and left artium. This is for the left upper one and the uh, the continue, continue. Uh, the lower one contain the coronary artery and left thank ventricle and aorta also. Thank, thank. Okay. Uh, Omar, I think Omar uh, took about describe the heart. Omar, uh, is it clear that you are not with me? Yahya, you said Yahya, Baha, you said Yad Abdurrahman Hisham. Describe the heart, you know? Abdurrahman Hisham, you don't know? Okay. Yes, sir, hey. Abdurrahman Hisham, you know? No. How, yes, sir? Okay. What about that, Abdurrahman Hisham? What about pulmonary artery, Abdurrahman Hisham? What about pulmonary artery? What is the function of pulmonary artery? What's the function what is the function of pulmonary artery? Who know? Who know already ran? Yes, I know, I know. You know, okay. Yes, Mr. It's a carry the oxygenated blood. Carries, it carries the oxygenated blood. Okay. From right ventricle to the lungs. Thanks. Thanks a lot. I want another one to give me. What is the function of aorta? Who can take part with me? Um, it's 
blood all over the body. Okay. The the water takes blood all over the body. Okay. I want uh, Ahmed. I think uh, Ahmed. Ahmed Ramadan. Ahmed Ramadan, you are with me? Ahmed Ramadan. What is the function of aorta? Uh, carry blood to all parts of the body. Thanks. Oxygenated blood. Oxygenated blood. You must take uh, oxygenated blood. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, Ahmed Ramadan. I want to go to the girls. The girls, you uh, studied well or no? I want to one of the girls to give me describe the heart. One of the girls, you understand or no? If you don't understand, raise your hand to know you understand or do, you don't understand. Raise your hand now about the girls. I want to one of the girls to give me uh, she understand or no. Hur. Okay, Hur. You understand the heart well? Yes. You understand everything or no? I do not understand very well, like I don't know. You don't like understand don't what, know. You, you don't understand what, I will explain another time, no problem. Uh, I will re-explain the heart another time, okay? I do not understand the right part of the heart. Okay, the right, okay. The right part of the heart, it will carry the deoxygenated blood. Deoxygenated blood, uh, follow me, I will, I will explain another time. Uh, deoxygenated blood means they are, uh, blood, okay, uh, which uh, um, uh, include, okay, deoxygenated blood, okay, or deoxygenated blood with the uh, not purified, doesn't contain oxygen, it doesn't contain oxygen, it contains mostly carbon dioxide, but less oxygen, most of them carbon dioxide. Then it will send to the lungs through pulmonary artery, okay, or? You understand now? Yes. Will I repeat? No, don't you repeat. Thanks. Yes, thanks, thanks. Right. One minute with me. I will give you uh, a video uh, to hear about the Inshallah, about the heart today. Heart is okay. Listen to this video, please. You hear or no? One minute uh, to uh, take part with you, participants. Okay, I want Omar. Uh, okay, or Hashim, or anyone, raise your hand. Hashim, Hashim, okay. You hear the video or no? Mr. I can't see the video, nor I can hear. You cannot hear the video? No, I can't. Okay, so I will I turn can't. on. I will turn on now. Then you see, can or can now? Now I can't. One minute. You can't hear now. Hear. You can't hear now. I can't. No, I cannot hear the video. Oh, you you can or you can't? Can't. Cannot. You can. You cannot hear. Yeah, I cannot. No, I will, okay, I will. One minute. Okay. Minute. You hear now, Hashem? Hashem. You hear? Yes, Mr. Yeah, great, great. Yes, yes. Relax and relax regularly to pump blood around the body. A sheep's heart will be dissected to show some of the different structures inside. A sheep's heart looks like a human heart and works in the same way. Anyone cannot hear, raise your hand. Anyone cannot hear well, raise your hand. So I'll continue now. If you cannot hear, raise your hand. Okay, I want. You hear or no, Mustafa? You hear well? I'm stopping it now, Mustafa, but you hear? Okay. Who is Muhammad? 
You hear well, Muhammad? Mr. I am speaking now. You Mr. I it? hear it, but the sound Mr. is too low. Can you increase the volume? Okay, now I want to increase it now. Okay, no problem. Okay. Oh. Don't worry, don't worry. That is the safety in front of you. This is the front facing view of the heart. This is how it sits in the body if you are facing the person whose heart it is. This is the back of the heart. The heart muscle contracts to squeeze blood out and then relaxes to allow blood to flow in. The muscle on the right side of the heart feels thinner than the muscle on the left side of the heart. This is because the left side of the heart has a thick muscular wall to pump blood around the whole body. This is the top of the heart. The vessels have been cut away. This is the apex of the heart. These are the coronary arteries. These special arteries bring oxygenated blood to the outer layers of the heart wall. The heart muscle has its own oxygen supply because it needs lots of energy to contract. If one of the coronary arteries gets blocked by a blood clot, here for example, it could cause a heart attack. This part of the heart would not get the oxygen it needed and so would not contract properly, disrupting the proper action of the heart. Now let's look at the blood vessels. This is the aorta. It is the largest artery in the body. It carries oxygenated blood out of the left ventricle all around the body. Notice how thick its wall is. This helps it to withstand the high pressure of the blood as it is pumped out of the heart. Here you can see into the right ventricle. The vena cava has been removed. The vena cava is the biggest vein in the body. It brings blood back to the right atrium from the rest of the body. Its wall is thinner than the aorta as the blood moves at low pressure. The pulmonary vein has also been removed. This flows into the left atrium, bringing blood back to the heart from the lungs. This vessel is the pulmonary artery. Notice how this also has quite a thick wall, though not as thick as the aorta. This vessel carries deoxygenated blood from the right ventricle to the lungs. Now let's look inside the heart. The muscular wall of the heart is cut from top to bottom, about two and a half centimeters to the left of the coronary artery. The heart is held open along the cut so that cutting can continue from the inside. The same is done for the other side, about two and a half centimeters to the right of the coronary artery. This is the left side of the heart. The top chamber is the left atrium and the bottom chamber is the left ventricle. Here is the right atrium and the right ventricle. These are the one-way valves between the atrium and the ventricles. They allow blood to flow down from the atrium into the ventricles, but not back up again. These tendons hold the valves down. The muscular wall on the left ventricle is really thick because it needs to produce a large force to push the blood out of the heart at high pressure so that the blood can travel all around the body and back again. The muscular wall on the right ventricle isn't quite as thick because the blood is only pushed from here 
to the lungs and back. The aorta has been cut open to show the one-way valves inside. The valves allow blood to flow out of the left ventricle into the aorta, but not back into the ventricle again. They are forced open when the heart muscle contracts and pushes on the blood, and they flap shut when the heart muscle relaxes. The pulmonary artery also has these valves. Let's follow the path of the blood as it moves through the heart. Deoxygenated blood from the body flows through the vena cava into the right atria, then to the right ventricle and out of the heart through the pulmonary artery to the lungs. Oxygenated blood from the lungs passes through the pulmonary vein into the left atria, then into the left ventricle and out of the heart through the aorta. It is important to realize that the 